And now for the power supply assembly, you're going to need acrylic parts A, B, and C. Alright, now time to mount the power supply. This being the top of your base, you're going to have the fan pointing down, away from your print bed. It's going to be blowing all the hot air down, so you don't want that blowing up on your print bed. All right, now we need to adjust, move around our nuts inside of our top aluminum bars here. This being your front, your right, and your left. On your front, you have six nuts. You want to separate them where you have one by itself on each end, and then two pairs in the middle. So you need to orient your nut to the bottom of the hole there, so your bolt will be able to catch on. Make sure you use the M3 10 millimeter bolts for this. Make sure you just hand tighten it so you can still slide the unit around. The acrylic needs to be able to move around so you can adjust it to the width that you're going to need it when you put your power supply on, onto it. On your right side you're going to be attaching acrylic part B. So use the same method. Line up your bolt And same thing, just loosely tighten it so you can adjust this as needed. On your left side, you're going to use acrylic part C. You want to make sure your loose nuts stays again between your part here and your, your back end. So line up your bolt. And just hand tighten it so you can move the part freely. For adjustment. Now to install the power supply onto the brackets you're going to need four M3 by 8 millimeter bolts. Line up your holes individually, hand tighten it in there, And you, you want to leave these hand tightened and the ones on the arms just loose enough where you can still move them around. So you can adjust those once you get the, the bed installed to the proper position that, that will work for you.